Mustafa, the presidential candidate of the Action Alliance AA in the 2023 general election, Ha Mustafa wants to contest for, pre uh, for presidency, like seriously, made the allegations during his appearance as a guest in the presidential candidate series on the 90 Minutes Africa with Rudolf Okonkwo and Chido Onoma. The chief security officer, CSO, of the late Nigeria military dictator, General Sani Abacha, Major Hamza Al-Mustafa retired as disclosed how Professor Yemi Oshibaju allegedly coached Sergeant Barnabas Jabila Mishola, aka Sergeant Rogers, on what to say to implicate him in the various high-profile political assassinations in the country during 1990s military junta. And Mustafa, the presidential candidate of the Action Alliance in the 2023 general election, made the allegations during his appearance as a guest in the presidential candidate series on 90 Minutes with Rudolf Okonkwo and Chidu Onuma. <laughs> Sergeant Rogers was a member of General Bachar Strike Force a clandestine group of highly trained soldiers responsible for silencing critics of the regime. During cross-examination at the Oputa panel, Sergeant Roger, Rogers confessed to having taken part in three assassinations under the direct order of Major Hamza al-Musafa. However, al-Musafa, who was convicted by a Lagos High Court for the murder of Kudirat Abiola, but later acquitted by the Court of Appeal, while answering questions during the interview, alleged that Sergeant Rogers had recanted the testimony he presented at the Oputa panel. The retired major said that Rogers confessed that Vice President Yemi Oshibaju, the Attorney General of Lagos State at the time, coached him on what to say to incriminate Al Mustafa. According to the former CSO to the late dictator, Sergeant Rogers and one Abdul Katanko came to the court and then revealed all that they were asked to say during the Oputa panel. He continued, Rogers made mention of the Lagos prosecutors, including the present vice president, who was the attorney general of Lagos State at that time. Rogers told the court that it was the attorney general of Lagos State and some of the prosecutors who I learned are now judges in Lagos High Court today who taught him what to say. He further stated that Toshibaju and Sergeant Rogers agreed to incriminate him and ensure the government killed him. The justification for me to be killed was what brought Rogers to read that narrative. The confession of Rogers is in black and white, captured by the Lagos State High Court, he added. The presidential candidate of the Action Alliance also promised to release his book documenting the events surrounding his tra travels after the Supreme Court gives a judgment in the ongoing trial. Okay. Hmm. Now, wow. I'm sure from the office of the Vice President, Yemi Shibayu, they are going to respond to this. What a story. So, Kudirat was killed by who? How would Attorney General of his state coach a criminal? Sergeant Roger admitted that he pulled the trigger. Then, who sent him? He belongs to a special squad who set up this evil squad. What exactly do you expect from Sergeant Roger, a drowning man? Anyway, he will all give accounts. We will all give accounts of our deeds before Amika one day. Don't mind Mustafa. He thinks everybody is a full animal person. That is for people with living conscience. Some of these people having uh deadened their who have deadened their conscience already. So there's nothing to warn them that all lies don't survive the grave. Professor Shibajo is trusted and will never descend so low to be involved in your allegations. Don't bet on that. You never can tell what politicians are capable of doing. Unfortunately, politics have no relation to morals. Wicked and heartless Mustafa don't know what is wrong with him. Did he thought Nigerians will forget soon all the atrocities he committed during Abacha regime instead of him to go incognito 
and be asking for God's forgiveness for his region, legion of sins against God and humanity. Mm. <laughs> so are you trying to say that uh, of course it's possible just to you know you know I was I was shocked that this man is contesting. I've been hearing AA, you know there's AAC or whatever. That's a party she will rest party. So when I see AA, I say I got confused. I just said, oh, I let them move on. So this is Action Alliance. It is a, it's now a presidential candidate. Low Batson. <laughs> just like I said, we are going to hear from the office of uh, the vice president. When the killers are looking for the killers, the killers will never be found. I still remember Suliat Ade Deji, Parawani, and so on, who were silenced by the killers, still looking for the killers. If man fails to account for his this year, he will be before his cradle. He will before his cradle. Because Sergeant Rogers is illiterate, I believe that that's why they guide him on what to say. All he knows is to kill and not writing. Bros, Major L. Mustafa, you are wicked during that period. Only now, no power. We can't be gentle. Oh, Coco. If you escape the judgments of human beings, Almighty God, judgment is waiting for you. It requires psychiatric uh, attention urgently. Nigeria, Nigerians are wiser than selfish ambition. I think Mustafa must be on Dramado with a bit of a Mbo Mary. I believe you must have seen the ghost of Kudirat and Nabiola chasing him in the dream. So he has to come and shout that Rujas and Oshiba you framed him up. So that uh, the ghosts can free him. I think I just want to have a you want to take people's mind away from what happened because it's it's contested. But at the end of it, it's not going anywhere anyway. You just want to put their name to uh be presidential candidates, all those things. I think it is a title now. Uh you contested as a presidential candidate, say uh, whatever, whatever. So 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 yeah. I think it's part of their resume. Please, Mustafa, allow sleeping dogs to sleep and heal. Don't grant such in service that open wounds. The only advice I can give you is for you to keep quiet and stop embarrassing yourself. Talk about your presidential manifesto. You the yarn another thing. We don't hear you tire for this uh, yatori. You don't begin to sound like a broken record. Una forever go learn una political lessons. The very people where they do now, now the same people who are they crying to. Now, wow. So, guys, let's hear your opinion and have your take on this.